Hey guys, Golden Donna here, and I am with my pal Sully. Hi. And today we're just gonna be talking about dealing with an awkward bus ride. Wait, what? Yeah. Okay. So like, think of it this way: like, like you and like someone else on a bus, and it's just absolutely awkward. <laughs> like awkward. You're staring at another person from across the bus. Just awkward eye contact. Yeah. It, like, like it could be that, or it could be like so much, so many other things as well. <laughs> Are you speaking from personal experience here? Okay, okay. Before you start judging me about it. <laughs> so wait, what happened? So I'm on a field trip, and there's this guy sitting next to me, and I have no idea what the heck to do. So I'm just frozen stiff for the entire time, <laughs> and like I'm just like, please let this end. <laughs> Imagine what the other guy is feeling, this random dude's looking at me. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so what other things could make a bus ride awkward? Okay, picture this. Okay. You're sitting down, and then like, you're just minding your own business, like maybe watching anime or something, and then someone just peeks out from behind you, just watching. Like someone's looking over your shoulder watching the anime. Oh, <laughs> exactly. That actually happened to me once, and it was the worst. It wasn't anime, but I was watching a show. Oh my gosh. So I was just looking like... over my shoulder. All right. Oh, okay. Here's one thing. This hasn't happened to me, but it happened to a friend. Like, someone accidentally fell asleep on them. So, like, someone, some, like, random person oh. was next to them, just, like, put their head, like, on their shoulder and was just completely out, oh just knocked out completely gosh. asleep. I thought of something even worse. What? Falling asleep on someone. Oh. <laughs> oh, that suck. Yeah. Have you ever heard of the serial killer driver fear? No. Picture it this way, like, you're alone on a bus, and, like, you want to go up and maybe, like, talk to the bus driver so you're not alone, mm -hmm. but you have no idea if they're, like, plotting to murder you oh or something like that. <laughs> that would be horrible. It would. God, but, and never drive, never going on a bus alone. Exactly, ever. exactly. One of, like, one of the main quotes of this TED Talk Never be on a bus alone. <laughs> exactly, don't. All right, so what are some things that can like make it less awkward? Easy, take up both seats. What? That's so rude though, that's so mean. So I feel like you would get kicked off the bus for that. <laughs> I probably would. <laughs> <laughs> okay, oh, I think this is one thing that's actually worked for a couple of my friends, but like pretending to be like insane, like if someone's sitting next to you and just like not screaming, but just like pretending that you have like completely lost your marbles. Yeah, and next thing you know, you get arrested and taken to Arkham Asylum. Okay, I'm saying that. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like if, if you're not completely insane, you should just be normal. I guess just like be normal and again, just like ignore it and not cause any ruckus or like any destruction on a bus. Or avoid a bus altogether. Yeah, pretty like pretty much that. That's our way of avoiding an awkward bus ride. Just don't avoid take buses. the yeah. Just like don't take the bus. Exactly. It, it's that simple. Any any closing remarks here? Basically, what we said: don't take the bus. Buses, especially at night, don't do that. Right, don't take the bus.